Ulla Schistet, he's the chairman of uh, Camp Sweden. Yes. Um, you lost yesterday to Ukraine. Yeah, sadly. Sadly enough, but uh, now uh, you, you have more games in Ukraine. Are you happy in general that your team is based in Ukraine? Yes, I think Ukraine is a very nice country to be in. But uh, if we had played in Poland, I think we might have brought even more supporters. But still, Ukraine is nice, I like it here. How many, uh, how many fans are now in Ukraine and how many would, it, would you have expected in Poland? I think, uh, I think you know, right now we are 15,000 Swedish people in Kiev and we expect almost 5,000 more for the game against England. But I think if we had played in Ukraine we could have been 30, 40,000. You mean in Poland? Yeah, in Poland, yeah, yeah sorry. Okay. So because people are a bit frightened to come to Ukraine or because it's more stressful mm, to, to be here? I think it's a mix. People are afraid of the rumors of violence and racism here, but also the hotel prices were extremely high when people planned their euro. <laughs> Did you ex experience anything positive or negative here which is outstanding? Anything outstanding? No, the, 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 I've been here in Ukraine 11 times and I, I, all the people here they are very friendly and helpful and uh, I, there is no reason at all to be afraid when you go to Ukraine in my opinion. Yeah. <laughs> Apart from maybe being a bit noisy from time to time. Yeah, but uh, yeah. noise is not yeah, the no. problem. <laughs> but, uh, but yesterday you met something special, maybe you can tell me. Yeah, I, I, I um, shaked hands with a Ukraine Prime Minister in the UEFA fan zone and uh, we made a bet about a beer on who would win the game. So now I owe him a beer and I don't know how to give it to him. <laughs> so are you going to send him a Swedish beer maybe? Or? Yeah, I will for sure give him a beer in some way. I'm not going to run away from the bet. I, I lost the bet. I will give him a beer. I think he will wait for it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, thanks very much, Olaf. Thanks.